much different than we've been playing in the last, I don't know, probably 10 games. So it was really nice to see them come back. One thing that we just, we haven't been cohesive together, either the front row's playing really well or the back row's playing really well. And tonight, um, that all kind of came together, which was nice. But, you know, I mean, ultimately when it comes down to it, when, you know, the it came right down to the end of the game, we just couldn't finish. And they just get nervous, you know, they let balls hit the ground. Um, it was that aggressiveness, so kind of tipping. And we talked about in the Hawk 10, um, tips, pushes, that kind of stuff is going to work. So, Catherine Leonard seemed like uh, she attacked the ball well tonight. Yeah, she attacked the ball much better than she has. Um, usually we have 10 kills, like 10 or 12 kills per game, per match. And tonight Kat had 10 um, of her own. And I think we had something like, they said 29 in the locker room. I had to review the stats. But, you know, that's what we've been talking about is, you know, to even compete against other teams, we have to have, you know, we have to have 20 plus kills. So it was nice to kind of see that. Bailey, Bailey Shelberg uh, got a lot of action tonight, played pretty well. Absolutely. Um, Bailey is a player that has been really special to me, um, as a, especially as a senior, so she didn't get her chance right away and never never was negative, never was negative on the bench, um, never had anything bad to say. She just kept working and working until, I guess, the point in practice, I just couldn't ignore her. I mean, mm -hmm. it, it just became so obvious that, that she was doing well in the back row, and so we gave her a shot in Nevada at our tournament, and you know she did just as well as anybody back there. So we gave her her shot, and she's really capitalizing on it, and I'm really glad she's in there now. Yeah, she held her own there. Uh, Megan Barron's had some nice sets uh, to let her to the company tonight. Absolutely. You know, I mean, Megan is really just the core of our offense, and um, I, I think she's pretty frustrated, I guess. You know, right now because Megan is just a go-getter. Yeah. She let, she loves to win um, in everything she does, and so. I think that this season has just been emotionally kind of tough on her because she really goes in there with that, you know, that winning mentality. And I, I think it's tougher on kids when, when they have that competitive edge, and Megan definitely has it. So, you know, I just have to keep reminding her that she's doing, you know, a really nice job and she's a great player. But you know, sometimes we just can't quite squeak up the point. Yeah, very close uh, sets tonight. Coach, uh, moving forward, what do we have coming up next? What we have coming up next is um, next Tuesday we'll have our triangular against um, Shenandoah in Red Oak. Red Oak is a team that I'm pretty concerned about. They're they're tough. Um, Sierra Athens is probably, I would say, my in my opinion, the best player I've seen um, this year. And I know that like Carol Kemper, they have some great players, but they're so tall that it just seems natural. And Sierra Athens just she really gets up and has a really really heavy ball. It's it's actually kind of frightening to watch. Um, so you know she's one of our concerns but I feel like our, our front row especially Riley Seifert yeah. um, I kind of I'm not gonna lie I kind of got discouraged with Riley for a little while in the beginning not not because she was doing anything bad but because she just wasn't being aggressive because you, when you see an athlete who has so much potential and then is just kind of playing timid and then she just somehow in this you know this last three games has come out of her shell again and is just really doing some huge things and you know, that gives me a lot of hope as well for next year because she's a junior, but I, I really couldn't be more, you know, more proud of how she's handling herself in the front row. Coach, how would you uh, grade the net play for the Trojans tonight as far as blocks and that type? I thought it, it was so much improved. Um, I I'd still wouldn't give it an A plus because we had some squeak by, but I would definitely give it as a teacher, a, you know, an A minus or a high B plus. <laughs> well, anything else to add? No, I just, I guess thank you to all the fans who came out. It was really nice to have everybody here, especially our student section. That was really yeah. fun, except for, I guess, when they were screaming uh, my full name, which was my need to be talked about tomorrow. Oh. No, just, <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah, it was, it was great to have a, a full crowd. And, um, you know, sorry we couldn't get the win, but getting better every day. Absolutely. Yeah, well, thank you very much.